Mitt Romney is pinning his hopes for a home state win on the economy. Chip Reed is in Royal Oak, Michigan tonight. Chip? Well, good evening, Scott. Mitt Romney has spent a lot of time in recent days arguing that he's more conservative than Rick Santorum. But today, on the final full day of campaigning here in Michigan, he returned to his bread and butter, creating jobs. Well, this sure has been fun these last uh, 10 days or so. We started off about, what, 15 points down in the polls. Now we're leading in the polls. Thanks, you guys. Appreciate the support. Mitt Romney today sounded increasingly confident best. that he will win in Michigan. He's trying to keep this battle on his own turf, the economy, where he believes Rick Santorum well, is most vulnerable. Senator Santorum is a nice guy. But he's never had a job in the private sector. He's worked as a lobbyist and worked as an elected official. That's fine. But if the, uh, the issue of the day is the economy, I think to create jobs, it helps to have a guy as president who's had a job. And I have. Romney was incorrect when he said Santorum never had a job in the private sector. As a private practice lawyer, Santorum counseled large corporations. Romney also raised questions with an offhand remark this weekend. While visiting the Daytona 500, a trip intended to show his ability to connect with ordinary people, he once again drew attention to his wealth when he was asked if he follows NASCAR. Not as closely as some of the most ardent fans, but I have some great friends that are uh, NASCAR uh, uh, team owners. If Romney does manage to win here, Scott, it should give him a boost next week on Super Tuesday. And he needs a boost because he's trailing in some of the polls in some key Super Tuesday states. Chip, thank you.